Silver just won the beach tournament here at Carolina Beach. Uh, did you enjoy the sand wrestling? I know, I know uh, you've had other family members try this before, but how was it for you? It was, it was a blast. Um, last time I competed was 2019, March 20th. I remember that because I went 0-2 at the NCAA tournament, and I've, I've definitely hurt since then, but uh, I knew I was ready to strap them up a little bit and, and beach nationals was something where i could have a lot of fun and just enjoy the competition how'd you prepare for this in the room somewhere or did you find a beach or some sand pit somewhere a uh, little bit of everything so i was able to coach a lot of my a lot of my uh, high schoolers i've been coaching like jake howell he's going to iowa next year um matt buck he's actually a cal baptist so I was coaching them wrestling with them and then honestly a lot of stance motion and uh elliptical <laughs> Yeah, well, scoring in the sand is difficult, right? What's it like on your legs if people aren't used to wrestling in this stuff? Honestly, it's I didn't quite feel the pop that I wanted. Um, I assume it's probably just because I couldn't really get my hips through on like a full penetration shot. So um, it was it was interesting. I, I enjoyed because I it's just focusing on holding position, but uh, it was it was cool. It was it was it was a fun system to learn. Now, you've got a family of wrestlers, right? What's it like with that, to have a whole group of people come through the system together and be supportive of each other? It, it's been a blast growing up, and I, 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 love, I love them so much, and I'm, I'm proud of them. Unfortunately, they were, they're hoping to wrestle for Israel today, but for security reasons, they weren't able to compete in the last chance, which my, my heart hurts for them. But um, oh, yeah. I know they'll, they'll strap it up and be ready to go, whatever's next. So are you looking to do any of the world events with the beat? I would love to. I would love to. I'm, I'm in grad school now, so I got to see how stuff lines up. But I was talking to Justin earlier, and I, I want to try to make as many of, of the events as, as possible because I, I had a blast today. Well, hey, congratulations on the victory. And, you know, a, another good day at the beach, huh? Hey, that's what it is, just having fun and wrestling. So you live in Colorado growing up, right? Yes, so, sir. So is life a mountain or a beach? Honestly, I, so it's funny. I grew up as a mountain man, but I, I absolutely love the beach. I moved. A little, I actually just recently moved out to Wilmington, so okay. um, I'll yeah, be beach you're wrestling. Yeah, 10 minutes from this beach. Exactly. I drove 20 minutes. I was like, hey, I gotta come here and, and well, get this some is beach like wrestling. Home field advantage, home sand advantage. It, right? Exactly. Yeah. I was like, I got the altitude from the uh, from the mountains, and then I come down here, and I'm I'm used to the sand. So let's go. But you guys got to all spray each other with the champagne. That's kind of a world tradition at the senior level. Is that fun? I mean, to have, kind of say, hey. This, this is kind of a cool thing to win this. Oh yeah, it was a blast. It was a blast. It was it was funny kind of just circling around and, and just letting it rip. I uh, I don't drink, so I was just trying to enjoy it as much as I can. I think just the event was fun itself. Well, hey, congratulations, and uh, you know hopefully we we'll get to see you in the sand this summer. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks so much for hosting an awesome event and, and covering it. And uh, yeah, let's go USA. Excellent. Thank you, man. Thank you so much.